<laughs> Freaking tripod. There we go. Oh my god. <laughs> Are we watching 17 again? Okay, so we got tie-dye kit, and that is for my socks. Oh crap, I'm missing one. Oh, here it is. Get up. Today we're gonna be tie-dyeing stuff to make like tie-dye clothing, basically. I got this idea from Marco, and he didn't show us what it looked like. And then the sock, we're not gonna talk about the sock, okay? We're forget. Just don't talk about the sock. Um, so yeah, I thought I'd order a kit and see if I can do it myself. I didn't think about doing this, but I did want to get these socks from American Eagle, and I thought they'd look cool and stuff. And then, a couple days later, I went to go check to see if I can get them, and they were sold out. So, yeah, it's basically going to be like this shirt. It's going to kind of look like this. I'm going to try and make two pairs. We can't tie that Yeah. Um, but yeah, this kit was super cheap. It was like $13 for this whole entire thing. It was on Amazon and yeah, it comes with like rubber bands and all that crap. So let's get a tutorial going and see if we can follow it and make some cool socks. What are you trying to tie on? Your shoes? Yeah. Your room is really a mess. Well, we gotta find something for you to tie dye. Uh, we're gonna tie dye this shirt. Okay, so I'm tie-dyeing my socks and maybe a shirt, and we're gonna tie-dye Lincoln's shirt. Oh, this is this isn't a good angle. Oh, um, wait a minute. Okay, guys, so um, we're all ready now. We got this thing. I don't really know if the camera's focused. I, I hope it is. Right. We're gonna be dyeing all this stuff, Lincoln's shirt, and two pairs of my socks. They look dirty. They're not dirty. They're they're washed. So. Are you just gonna eat airheads the whole entire time? Yeah, I'm saving this one. Okay, so if you are doing this at home, make sure that you are doing it over a towel or I'm using a cardboard box and a towel. And then I'm gonna put plastic inside of this too, maybe, I don't know. And if this dye gets anywhere, it will wreck your whole entire life. So be careful. Yeah, let's open this up. <laughs> Okay, so this comes with plastic, holy crap, a bunch of rubber bands, like too much rubber bands. And then a bunch of gloves. Okay, so before we tie to anything, get my phone out of my pocket. No, that's not how we take off our clothes, buddy. This is how we do it. Ah, yeah. It didn't work. <laughs> uh, let's start rubber, not rubber banding. I'm gonna look up a tutorial and we can see how we do this. It's gonna be a great day always. You're right. So let's quickly run through what supplies you guys will need to do this. But first things first, you're gonna need white socks. They don't have to be Nike socks, they just have to be Got white. Em. So all of your dyes come like this with a little bit of dye powder on the bottom and then yes. you just add water to whatever color you're not going taking to use. Out this. Okay, so basically, I think this looks like the right color. Okay, I'm just gonna use this, but try and not do the whole entire sock so there's some white spots. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna go fill this up with water. I'll be back in a minute. Oh, put our socks in the water. Oh. Ew, this ew. Oh my God, my socks, they're like stained. They're not dirty, they're not dirty. Okay, so we got our socks right here laying down. How do I put them? I'm guessing we just put a rubber band on it. I'm not even gonna finish watching this. Okay, this is what our socks looking like right now. It's it's a ball, and yeah, we're gonna make them light blue. Crap! I forgot to do the other one. Oh God! Moment of truth. Make sure I go over the areas that I am putting the color. Ah, scary. Good luck. Keep the cup. Why? I've already seen it. Once. I'm wasting all my dye, but I dyed the sock. I dyed one of them. We're going for the other one. I'm just gonna do this on it. So this one has a bit more dye than this one, but it's all in a ball. So I don't know if there's only gonna be dye on one side. I'm gonna put them in a baggie. And if you guys don't like this video, it's not a flipping video. So <laughs> you guys were getting tired of flips and you don't like what I'm doing right now, then that just sucks. 
For these next socks, I want them to be uh, kind of a mixture between like pink and orange, like this picture. So, um, yeah, that's what I'm gonna be doing. I got these two filled up now, and I hope it looks good. You have to wear the mask. You have to wash them. I'm pretty sure the base color is pink and there's orange on top because it kind of looks like the pink is like blended. Now time to do the orange. I hope it looks orange. orange. Okay, so this is actually looking kind of cool. Switching it up. I'm gonna put the caps back on them and put these bad boys in a bag. Do mine. Boys, things to do while in quarantine. Mm -hmm. I wanna uh, so yeah, now it's, now it's time that we do Lincoln's thing. What do you want your shirt to? What do you want? What, what color do you want this to be? Uh, black. No, no, it's gonna be tie dye, not black. What's your favorite color? Green and uh, black and green. You should do green and orange. <laughs> Get your hands out of your pants. Anyway, red. Red and what? Two colors. Uh, I say pink and red. Pink and red are literally the same color. Pick something up. Do you want pink and green? Yeah. Okay, so Lincoln decided on uh, green and pink. And I don't, I don't know how to tie-dye a shirt, but I'm just gonna spiral it like uh, she did in the video. Do, do you have white in there? I was gonna say, I went to go get your prescription, I forgot. I went to get your prescription. I'm gonna try it. Wait, wait, I don't want to mess it up. Wait, 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 wait. Here. Go. Oh my god, look at it. Oh my god. We're gonna have no more dark pink. That looks like. Yeah, it looks like a watermelon shirt. <laughs> don't touch it, don't touch it. Lincoln, here, wait, wait, wait. Put that in there. Small enough. And we're gonna probably have to clean all this up. So clean up, clean up time lapse. Guys, we got it on the table. That freaking sucks. We have to wait eight hours. Eight hours from now is one o'clock. You freaking kidding me? I'm just gonna leave it overnight and we'll wash it in the morning. Okay guys, so I'm recording this on my phone because I don't feel like getting my camera. But right now it is 10 o'clock and I have this stuff. They've been soaking for like six hours, but it was like six to eight hours or something like that. We're not gonna wash them right now, but uh, we are gonna wring them out and put them underneath like cold water in the sink. I think I put way too much dye on this. Oh, that's a lot of dye. Okay, so we're gonna wait to do those socks in the morning because like I really don't want those to be messed up. If they mess up, I'm gonna have to do it again. <laughs> These came out a bit like lighter, but I put a lot of dye in them. Okay, so I'll see you guys in the morning. Goodbye. Uh, it's the next morning, and I just did the other socks. Morning. And they're literally pink. I don't know if I put too much dye in them. The blue ones look good. I'm gonna get another pair, and I'm gonna try and do those off camera, and then I'll show you guys at the end. Okay, guys, so it's been about two days since the last clip, and I'm outside right now in the disgusting rainy weather. Put my socks. It was kind of a fail. Anyway, um, just look at them. I messed up on these ones. I don't know what was up with the dye on these. I don't know, but they literally turned out like pink. These were the original pair of orange and pink ones. But anyway, these are the second version that I tried to do. Literally the same thing. But yeah, they just look like pink socks. But yeah, if I always want to dye them like a different color, I can. So yeah, that's the end of the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. But thanks for watching. See ya. Ball and yeah.
for You have to wash them. I say pink and red.